buy the minimum of the product. Let's make pace wisely. The first factor and the last factor. So we get x squared plus 4x plus 1x, so 5x, and then plus 4, right? And the remaining pair, this and this. So we get x squared plus 5x plus 6. Now we write the first factor as x squared plus 5x plus 5 minus 1. The second, x squared plus 5x plus 5 plus 1. We can view that as A, that as B. So that would be A minus B. And the second factor would be A plus B, right? So using difference of squares formula, so we get A squared, so it would be X squared plus 5X plus 5 squared minus B squared, 1 squared. We know the first term must be non-negative, right? So we get greater than or equal to 0 minus 1. So the minimum would be negative 1. When we can obtain the minimum, the minimum of negative 1 can be obtained if the first term equals 0, right? So we get x squared plus 5x plus 5 equals 0. We can use quadratic formula to figure out that. So x equals negative b plus minus square root of b square minus 4a say divided by 2 times a. So you see that would be negative 5 plus minus square root of 25 minus 20 equals 5 over 2. That means when x equals negative 5 plus or minus square root of 5 over 2, the expression get a minimum negative 1. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you.